Now, as for the vote tonight, the board voted unanimously to pass this proposal. It will affect what middle schools hundreds of students will attend, and some parents aren't happy. One controversial decision changing up an entire school district. Motion carries 7 0. After months of meetings, the board voted tonight to change the boundary assignments for two Parkway Elementary Schools. Paramount Elementary students will go to South Middle School instead of West, and Hannah Woods Elementary students would go to Southwest Middle School. Parents sharing their concerns. This is not the time to make these changes for these for these children. Our kids have been through so much. Paramount parent Michelle Fusner says the decision disrupts her son's education and breaks up her family. My son is a fifth grader. He has known for six years that he will go to West Middle and be a junior Longhorn. Now within a matter of months, he will have to switch gears and not be able to follow in his sister's footstep, who is currently at West Middle. The district says the proposal will solve an enrollment issue. Parkway says it did a study that found West at full capacity, where South and Southwest Middle schools don't have enough students. Parkway spokesperson Paul Tandy says the plan gives more equality. We have a middle school that's overcrowded and then two middle schools right next door that have extra space. We have learning environments at the overcrowded school that are not optimal and we owe it to those kids, all of our kids, to find a better way to provide the very best education we can. Tandy says students will still be able to attend the same high school as before. Fusner says she's tired of the changes. They cannot continue to just you know, ping pong us back and forth. They need to come up with a solution that is um, sustainable, something that can account for these ebbs and flows in the different areas. The change will go to effect next fall and would affect nearly 500 students in the next four years. Live in Chesterfield, Amelia McGovero, Fox 2 News. 